Welcome to WNBA Basketball on 2K Sports. In this game, we'll see the Los Angeles Sparks against the Las Vegas Aces. And from Sin City, I'm Blake Suniga, joined by two terrible poker players, Brian Banifatemi and Tim Swartz, and we're in for a good one tonight. Two strong front courts. The bigs will surely be in focus tonight. What should we look for? Here we go. Who controls the boards in a game with elite front courts? You want to limit second chance points? Well, I'm interested in how much these front courts create. They're going to get so much attention. So how's their ball movement? Can they set up others for open shots? Wilson gets a three-pointer to fall. Well, you might be surprised by Williams' court vision, but she isn't. She knows she can make sharp passes offensively. Now here's Agumake. And she can't answer back the three-pointer offline. One-on-one, -on -one fast break. Young shot is off. Right side, Tolliver. There's the three. The Sparks, no good that time either. You have to respect how Liz Cambage excels at this game. She makes her presence felt on offense and defense, racking up a solid number of buckets and rebounds. Right side, Tolliver. Oh, and the fouls hard that time. Chelsea get two shots at the line. It's going to be on Chelsea Gray. Getting to the line is critical if you want to be a top shelf scorer like Tolliver. She just knows how to attack the defense. And first trip to the free throw line for her in this one. good. On the offensive end, Cambage can be particularly unstoppable, posting some truly jaw-dropping point totals. How about record point totals? Of course, Liz Cambage, the single game scoring record, setting it back in 2018 with 53 points. Wow. She hits both from the stripe. Third pick in the draft. WNBA All-Star, WNBA Champion. I mean, what hasn't Tolliver accomplished in this league? Chelsea Gray for three. It's hauled in by the Sparks. Ogumake outside. And Chelsea Gray with the block. Great discipline and timing from Gray. We know what she can do offensively, but I hope you're not forgetting about what she can do defensively. Stolen by Cambage. Pass to Wilson. Here's Young. Takes the assist and lays it in. Picked out the pass nicely. A nice fast break from start to finish. And what a finish it was, guys. Just so pretty. The pass, the dunk, everything. Now here's Tolliver. Now we be. Wilson with it. Guarded now by Tolliver. Young shot's good. That's just great ball movement. And that's key this run. Passing it with a purpose. The D has not been able to keep up. Ogumake with the ball. She's guarded by Wilson. Today, and it's Ogumike. in. Took some time, but they get one to go. Derek Maybe they're Ogumike. warmed up now. Let's see. Wilson outside. Gray. Williams. She's covered by Ogumake. The three. It's hauled in by Wheeler. The Sparks trailing. And here in the first, approaching three minutes played. And out of bounds, the Aces will take it. So both teams making some changes here. Now, Wheelers, she's got some serious skills, whether it's uh, creating off the dribble, a deadly pull-up. Uh, she's a great passer as well. From outside the arc, Kelsey Gray grabs the miss. Wilson with it. Now we be on her. Shoots from 12. No good on the shot. A bit long that time. 
And they've been looking at a sink offensively. They need a bucket in a big way here to regain some confidence. And the outside fires from deep. The Sparks grab the miss. And they can go two for one. Most importantly, play it smart. Sykes, gray defending. Sykes with the bucket. Even at 5'9", no fear from Sykes. She played way bigger than her height. Tremendous heart. Erica Amby on the wing. Shakes her out to Gray from the yard. That shot, no good. And it's the Sparks ball. Trailing by four. Outside Wheeler. Wilson pulls it down. Gray outside. Plum. Hamby outside. Here's Wilson. Good. And Erica Hamby gets the assist. Love the selfless, intelligent play by Hamby. Puts the ball into the wide That's open the shooter's hand. And we've reached the end of the first quarter. The Aces on top, up by six. And we'll be back with you shortly. Get ready for the Gift Squad! All right, the second quarter beginning in just a moment. And uh, guys, what's your take on the Aces so far? Lots of running to start the game here. It's a tempo that they like, and they're getting some easy buckets in transition. Now here's Plum. Quiet so far offensively, searching for her first points of the game. Wilson. And she didn't get quite enough under that one. Zowie B down low. Pass to Cooper. Rebound by the Aces. Well, that's just not a sight you see very often because she has a great feel for that jump shot, especially with So many great organizations in this league, but does one stand out as the best franchise? If I have to pick just one, Seattle. Great ownership group, a healthy amount of titles, superstars that have been there a long time, and awesome fans. They check all the boxes. I can't go wrong with the Storm, but I'll take the Lynx. Uh, they have a strong team culture, an ability to turn late picks into stars, and of course, a bunch of banners from the 2010s. Throughout her career, Raquana Williams has struggled with injuries. But she seems to always come back even stronger. Fast as how we be. Got it. Good and job in the low post. The ace is leading. And when you look at Amanda Zawi B, this Swedish center possesses some nice versatility. Specifically, her ability to knock down three-pointers. And out of bounds, the Sparks will take the ball it. ball goes to Los Angeles. Second quarter, and we're just over a minute in. Young with the steal. Unhindered going all the way. Here's Plum. She gets it in there. Incredible body control. Taking the hit and still knocking it down. A growing trend in basketball, bigger players are starting to take more threes. And you can add Zowie B to that list, which makes her a valuable commodity. And it's something that uh, she continues to work on because spacing, obviously, in the modern game, it is everything in basketball. And, and Zowie B, at her size, offers plenty of this.
And here in the second with about a minute and a half gone by. Pass to Plum. Back to Young from past the arc. Out of bounds, it'll be the bounds. Sparks ball. The ball goes to Los Angeles. Here's Tolliver. Now here's Zowie B. Back to Tolliver. Pass to Cooper for three. He can't get it to go. So Las Vegas will take it the other way. Two minutes remaining in the first half. Plum. Wilson, she's guarded by Plum. Now Zowie B. That's Amanda good, and Zawi she's now B. three for four from Assist the goes to She's really Maria getting involved Diva. in the offense here after being held without a single point in the first quarter. Rookwana Williams goes in. Pass to Park. Plum. Here's Park. Covered by Zowie B. They get it back. Here's Wilson. Here's Park. And at last, they get one to fall. The coach has always told me that if you battle for offensive rebounds, you're guaranteed a high-quality shot on the follow, just like she got there. Zowie B with it. Fires for three. It's hauled in by Park. Outside Plum. No good on the triple. The Sparks trailing. Pass to Badiva. Misses in close. Fires from 14. The shot will not fall. And it's the Sparks the other way. Over to the wing. And stolen by Raquana Williams. Here's Wilson. And another miss by Las Vegas. And just over Daniel, three and a half minutes played in the second quarter. Sparks ball. Substitution for Los Angeles. And that'll be It'll Los be Angeles time. ball as Sparks it goes ball. out of bounds. Smart substitution ball here. Second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. Sykes with the bucket. Defensively, they're on their heels every time the ball comes inside. And if they don't start showing some aggression, things are just going to get worse. Back to Cambage. Gray outside. Pass to Cambage. Hamby. Offline with the three. Ogu McKay outside. Watches it. And we're through the first half of play here in what's been a good one. The Aces on top, they're up by four. And we will be right back after halftime for the start of the third quarter. See you in just a bit. about to get underway and it's been a close one so far without question Zowie B displaying her skills today well I think it'll be important to see if they can stop her down in the second half because so far they have not had any answer for her when she's down on the block yeah maybe mixing up her looks bumping her out front her double down just do something to throw her off her rhythm the start of the second half getting underway. Both teams battling hard through the first two quarters. Gray outside. Pass to Williams. Now Wilson. 
Guarded by Wheeler. Outside Williams. The three-pointer off the mark. Low block shot. Ogumake can't hit. Here's Las Vegas. Their biggest lead of the game was nine. And when you watch Ogumake play, what impresses you right away is how consistent she's been. She's been in the league over a decade. And it's pretty easy to see why. Now here's Young. Pass to Gray. Here's Williams. Gray, guarded by Wheeler. Back to Young. Clock at six. Off target from outside. And Ogumake is a former MVP for a reason. She understands her strengths and plays to them really well. And you know, Neck is one of those players that does whatever is asked of her. When her team needs more out of her, more offense, she steps up. Her, her really a uh, selfless attitude, it's why she's so effective and such a strong leader. Cam Beige, covered by Zowie B. Young shot's good. A towering physical presence. Cam Beige's ability to see over defenders helps her routinely make plays. They need a good offensive possession. Yeah, it's been a long time without a bucket. Focus. Back to Wheeler. It's Amanda Zawi B, high post. Just a little over 90 Amanda seconds gone Zawibi. in the third quarter. Solid play on the low block, and that one's good. Pass to Williams. Young. Wilson outside. Now here's Gray. Cam Beige, covered by Zawi B. Now Williams. Two minutes remaining in the third. No Two good minutes. from outside. Their offense scuffling a bit in the second half. Just one for five. Here's Ogumake. That one falls. Shanae, Ogumake. Turning a missed basket into points. It what Ogumake can do as good as anyone in the WNBA. Not quite two and a half minutes played here in the second half. Back to Williams. Young, pass to Williams. And the three ball is good. So skilled at the catch and shoot game. Williams doesn't need much time or space to get her shot off. Ogumake with the ball. She's guarded by Wilson. From deep three point range, the shot comes out. And Las Vegas the other way now. Outside Young. Good, and it's Chelsea Gray who picks up the assist. You sit back and enjoy the poise from Young. Maybe not the highest percentage shot with the contact, but she still sinks it. Here's Ogumake, and she uses the glass on the layup. That's what I call pretty passive. Timely recognition as to where the open teammate was. Liz Cambage, high post. Pass to Williams. Back to Gray. Cambage, covered by Zowie B. Back to Gray. From deep. And the aces, another three. One aspect of their play today that's been far superior is their passing. And that kind of flow, it can be elusive, uh, but the great offenses have it. And that's just what they've shown tonight. A three from Christy Tolliver. She has slipped into a real funk here. Definitely. The basket is not looking very big to her. This Defensively, they just don't seem to be giving the same effort they were in the first half of the game, and I'm disappointed. Now we be down low. Excellent D there from Liz Cambay. And as we end the third quarter, a double-digit deficit will make it tough to come back. The Aces on top, up by 10. And we're coming back right after this break to get the fourth quarter started. And now let's take a look at our assist of the game presented by State Farm. Well, she's always the favorite to bag this honor. These kind of feeds are her bread and butter. Well, you can't run away from the DNA. When she's running the show, she makes sweet highlight reel plays night in and night out. 
Come on, fans, it's the fourth quarter. And the quarter. final period of play Get just about to get started here. Now Cooper. Oh, Oakland McKay outside. Pass to Wheeler. And here is Sykes. To the wing, right side. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on a Today, That is their first Go foul of the game. First personal foul, teams first. Martin's making a switch here. Mia Coffee. Outside Plum. Chelsea Gray, the open look. That one's on Chelsea target from the wing. In terms of perimeter defenders, who would you say is at the top of the league? Jasmine Thomas is as good as it gets. A tireless worker on the defensive end. He's been first team all defense a few times. And in terms of backcourt defenders, aerial action can really frustrate opponents. She plays with great fire. And her defense earned her spot on the team going to the games in Tokyo. Man, these guys have had some good motion on offense. Nice assists. When everybody's involved offensively, it's in a way helping you defensively, too. To the middle. Here's Cambage. And she was fouled on the way up. Two free throws for her. First personal foul. It's going to go on Neko Gumake. First team foul. When you allow Cambage to get the ball that deep, you really have no choice but to foul. Shooting too smart, Vegas. too tall to stop. When we talk about Liz Cambage, you got to talk about her post presence and how she can put a team over the top, you know, the middle of that offensive area. The key, Cambage Jones. The first one falls. And you talk about Cambage down low. There aren't many teams that can match up with her. Well, yeah, and she put it best herself. An opponent talked about her physicality and how difficult it is to face her. And she just simply came back with, if they can't handle it, get in the weight room or get out of the post. And good on both. It was five years between WNBA seasons for Liz Cambage. But what did she do when she returned to the league? lead the league in baskets made a talented offensive force no question who's been in control of this game yeah absolutely they've uh, really taken charge that's good and so Asia Wilson with the assist they'll take as many of those high percentage shots as they can make and here are the sparks now Foul call that five. time on the way up. Nice and that was first personal the foul, teams first. first it's very team hard foul. to stop Adumake. She gets the Shooting line a lot. And when she gets there, she's a 75% shooter. Two shots. Shooting two. Free throw, no good. The first overall pick back in the 2014 draft. Chenea Gumake has become a very good player in this league. But guess what? She's also become a tremendous analyst as well. She hits the second from the line. And Ogumake has said she never expected to have a career in broadcasting. Well, she's got one now, and to be honest, she's been great. She's branching out beyond basketball. In fact, sports altogether. The Stanford grad is one smart cookie, paving a new path and paying it forward. Now here is Sykes. Soft touch off the glass. This is when Sykes is at her best, attacking, going fiercely at the hoop. Gray, left side. Good, and the assist goes to Liz Cambage. That's the type of lead pass we've really come to expect from her. Pass to Okumake. And here is Sykes. Gray defending. Sykes, no good. 
Those chances, usually they're two points for her. The D, I guess, did just a, enough to bother her. Wilson, no good. Just like me, nine times out of ten, she's going to bury the three when she's left all alone like that. Sinead Ogumake gets it to go. This is just unselfish basketball at its finest. You just know that Sykes' teammates appreciate her willingness to share the wealth. Now here's Hamby. Outside Plum. Back to Gray. Outside Plum. Gambay. And they convert at last on attempt number three. And they're getting that lead way up there by now. It should be easy for them the rest of the way. Yeah, and at this late stage of a game, a lead like that has a team pulling off the good. The other one's ball. bad. Asia Wilson, second personal foul, second team foul. Shooting for Los Angeles, Shanae Okumike, taking two shots. Shooting two. The first free throw is good. Well, it's funny. She's not just a great basketball player. Agumake is also a great TV analyst, putting guys like us on the hot seat. And so she hits both. Here's Las Vegas. Pass to Williams. And stolen by Sykes. Pass break. Here come the Sparks. Here's the Diva. They get it again. Cooper. And the layup is good. Way to crash the offensive glass there. And once she gets her hands on it, you know it's going back up and in. Now here's Cambage. Defense right on him. And it's Gray missing. Here's Cooper. Gray defending. Here's Vadiva. And the layup is good oh, yeah. after a nice lead pass. This run really not doing them any good coming as late as it has. Yeah, but give them credit for showing the fight they're showing, Tim. It would have been really easy to just throw in the towel by now. Yeah, but it's still going to be a loss probably. Back to Hamby. From deep. Rebound by the Sparks. Impossible for them to come back now. Yeah, just too much work and not enough time. So the whistle Los blows Angeles. on the shot. Two yeah. free throws for the contact there. First personal foul. Have to respect Cambage's dedication to the play. Draws a foul and Vegas still Vegas. manages to get the Where shot in the air. Cambage. Two shots. First one falls for her. So she gets them both. Sykes outside. The layup off target. So it's the Aces winning this one easily. Even early on in this one, it seemed like they were happy to be playing at home tonight. It makes a big difference. Make sure you Once they started to really play in a good flow, it felt like uh, they never had any doubts that they'd come out on top. So that's going to do it for this one, folks.